Hello, hello, this is Diana from Ionic Themes and I want to record a quick video explaining how to upload your Ionic project into Firebase hosting in order to be able to have a public URL of our project to be able to share it with our colleagues or to paste it in our blog or anywhere. So I will start, this is my Ionic project and this is my console pointing to that project. So first we have to make sure we have already installed the Firebase CLI and that we have a, an updated version. So in order to do that, you have to run this. This will in install the, the required Firebase tools to be able to, to manage our project from the console, from this console. Well, it's done now. So now we can run Firebase init in order to initialize um, a Firebase project in our Ionic application. So this will start a wizard. In our case, we will choose that we want to use Firebase hosting because as you may know, Firebase has a lot of other functionalities. If you want to learn more, we have lots of tutorial with Firebase integrations in our blog, in Ionic Themes blog. Make sure to check them out. So we will select hosting. Oh, sorry. It was with the spacebar. This way. Now we can either use an existing Firebase project or create a new one. I will create a new one. We have to choose a name, Ionic Sliding Tabs. Because I didn't mention, but the project I'm uploading to Firebase, it's a demo of how to create a, a sliding tabs with Ionic. Of course, you can get the code for free. So now we have to specify where our where will be the um, the assets that Firebase will upload. So. In our case, we are building an Ionic app. When you run this command, Ionic build, in order to build the application, this folder will automatically get generated with all the, the assets needed for our app to be served. So we will point to this folder. We will type www configure as a single page app, yes, please. Set up automatic builds, no. So now it asks if we want to uh, overwrite the index HTML file, which is inside our W folder that is, sorry. Um, where is it? Here, sorry. And we don't want to, to overwrite, to get this overwritten. So we will type no. So everything is set up. We can see that new files were created. This one and this one, which contain the configuration for the Firebase project. So now we are ready to run Firebase deploy. This will, if, if everything, was set up correctly, this will create a new URL for us with our application. So this is, let's see if it worked. Yay. Sorry. This is our app. As you can see, it's being served from this URL, which is in hosted in Amazon. Sorry, in Firebase. Uh, so that's all. Uh, this is an example of Ionic sliding tabs I made just for fun and I will share the code with you. Feel free to use it in your projects. I really like the final result. 
so in this video I showed you how to upload your project to Firebase so now each time you want to to add a new feature or an update you just need to run ionic build in order to refresh the W folders and then just type Firebase deploy again and a new version will be deployed hope this video was useful for you please let me know your thoughts and Stay tuned. Bye.